to be showing you how I got this super defined flat twist out. If you are interested in seeing how I achieved this look, stay tuned. All right, I'm gonna start off with coconut oil. I'm gonna go ahead and do the lock method with coconut oil, the coconut moisture cream. This one is an old with our old labels and it's pretty crappy, sorry guys. And then I'm gonna be using um, something that I made a while ago. Um, it is actually when I was working on making the body butters that we used to sell at Unobi you know, Shop. And I don't, know, I don't know how I made it. I do not know. It, it was a, pretty much a fail for the body butter, but it is awesome for my hair. I'm going to try to figure out what I did and maybe start um, selling that again. But anyway, it does have a pumpkin scent because it was for one of the pumpkin floral, I mean the fall scents that I have with the body butter. I'm going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to section each, each um, just do my hair in two sections and I'm just going to moisturize both sections with uh, the coconut oil first. Then I'm using the coconut moisture cream. And I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And then when I'm done with that, I will begin twisting. And now I'm going to go ahead and get started flat twisting my hair. I'm going to start in the back and I'm going to flat twist the back section up toward the front. And um, I'm just flat twisting so that my hair will lay on my left side. So that would be the direction I'll be flat twisting it. And then I'm just using my moisturizer that I um, was talking about earlier. Just always to the ends and just gonna go ahead and start flat twisting. If you guys know how to flat twist, that's basically how I'll be flat twisting. There's no different, I have no different technique or method or anything like that. Um, I'm basically flat twisting in a direction that I'm able to flat twist in because I have trouble flat twisting in, um, in different directions. So I have to work with the direction that I'm good at, so. That is how I'm flat twisting. Like I said, I'm going to do these to the front, all the way to the end. And I'm going to do the whole back row. Now I'm going to go ahead and get started on the front section and I'm just going to flat twist um, this section to the side. I'm not going to do it towards the front, I'm going to do it to the side. So basically, basically when I take these out they should all kind of lay over to the side. That's the thing about having an undercut, you have to wear your hair on one side or the other. You don't have to, but I choose to. I really don't know, I don't really like the way it looks if I try to wear it like straight back or anything like that. So. You either kind of have to wear it to one side or kind of wear it just to the front. So I'm basically going to be trying to get these flat twists to go towards the front and to the side. So I'm going to go ahead and start on the front section. And like I said, if you guys know how to flat twist, um, I'm not really doing a detailed tutorial. This is not really just a, a, a tutorial. This is mostly how I achieve this look, um, how I achieve this flat twist out.
Okay guys, now I am back to take the twist down. I got some oil on my hands just to make it, to try to reduce the frizz. I've had these twisted for two days and I am now going to take them down so you guys can see the results of my flat twist out. The definition is sick. I just have to warn you. The definition is absolutely gorgeous. Okay, and this is the final look. Thank you guys for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.